Anna, in your keynote yesterday, you mentioned that it's not just about having collecting all the data anymore. You need the skill sets to be able to use it, and that's hard. But you mentioned citizen developers. What's a citizen developer? Well, a citizen developer is actually a person who has a bit of technical affinity and who is uh, ready to use um, lo so-called low-code, no-code platforms, which allow you, which allow him or her to actually build his or her own app. But where does low-code and what Mindex is doing, where does that fit into all this? Well, it's actually a productivity tool for developers, if you ask me, and it is actually a tool for non-developers to do and digitize the environment of, of, of his or her own workplace or the processes he or she works in. Basically, it's giving is a tool set which gives more people than developers the ability to, digit, to do a, perform a digital transformation in his surrounding. Before, in my world, the IT guys did all the coding. Now anybody in the business units can innovate and create their own code. What does that do for the IT department? Well, I, I guess, you know, it sounds frightening, isn't it? Yeah. On the other hand, it is actually not, because when you think about it, we, have, we are in a, in a practical, in a war of talent situation, and we have a, really a gap between demand and supply. So to bridge that gap, I think it, is, it must be of the interest of every CIO, every IT leader, to enhance the workforce, their own workforce with additional people. That means we, we, talk, we call it democratization of IT. That means that we want to give a, a certain freedom to our business to feel also empowered to do digital transformation by themselves. Of course, we do backend integration and we also help them and guide them how to utilize the tools best because not always they are totally intuitive and we do some pre-composing, but this is, I think, where we see it's also the future of IT. The future of IT is really not to do everything by themselves, but actually to empower other people and to really make things happen and by enlarging the workforce as we have now ourselves.